Hello everyone, this is me Satya here and I'm back with the second week of February reads start from the 8th through the 14th of February 2023. This reading is going to be for the sign of uh, Leo. So Leos, let's see how this uh, week is going to be for all of you out there. I will be adding oracle cards and a lot more in this reading, so stay tuned and before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it's a general read, it may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. Always pick the signs and messages that resonate and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's dive into the read and let's see how this week is going to be for Leo's. What is coming in for you for this week? Let's begin. Wow, the devil. Five of Swords, the world, a lot is going to change for you, three of Wands, and with Rick, we do have ten of Swords. I really feel like, you know, there is a specific situation that you have been dealing with uh, that had become toxic for you to, to be in, to deal with. You are going to put an end to that. It can be a relationship for majority of you, to be very honest. I really feel like, you know, or it can be a job situation. Probably you were working somewhere that you felt like, you know, there is a lot of toxicity of the colleagues or, you know, the higher ups. You are going to choose to put an end to that. You are going to choose to pull yourself, uh, you pull yourself out of that so you could do something good for yourself. You could do something that you deserve for yourself. I really feel like you know it's more about you understanding that um, you are worthy of more than you know what you're getting. Uh, being in that situation is toxic. Being in that situation is painful. So I really feel like you know you are definitely choosing to put an end to the pain and suffering that you're currently feeling and dealing with. Uh, be that in love, work, or home life situation, maybe you're, you're you're not appreciated at your work front. You do all the work. You do all you know what it takes to. You know uh, get appreciated and loved and you know um you know acknowledged but you're not getting that so i really feel like you know you are going to look deep into it, the situation and instead of like you know feeling lack of that accomplishment in your life you are going to choose to do the right things there are nobody to tell you that you are not worthy of the appreciation you are going to choose yourself to move on from that situation from that job from that you know particular um you know, uh, whatever area it applies to, you are going to choose to pull away from that situation and putting an end to it. You're not going to be like letting people uh, take you for granted. You're not going to let people, uh, you know, use you. You're not going to let your specific someone take advantage of your kindness or your truth, you know, or the love that you have for this person. So if, you know, somebody is trying to control you or trying to kind of like, you know, make you do things that they want and instead you know in, in return you never get what you deserve i feel like you know you are going to be strong enough to take a stand for yourself and pull yourself away from that person that situation um changing yourself changing your attitude changing your behavior you are going to decide that no you have done it you have been there you have tried your you know all that you could now you cannot take it more so that stance that you're taking it's all because you understand your worth now you understand what you're worthy of you understand that you know uh being in that situation is not healthy for you for your mental health for your physical health for your emotional health it's not good so you are going to take certain steps in this week time and you know move forward in your life if this is a person that you're dealing with who is taking you for granted and who is ignoring you neglecting you making you feel bad in this situation I really feel like, you know, maybe you're not going to choose to leave this person completely. You're probably going to stop doing the effort that you are putting in this connection. You are going to detach till this person comes to offer you something stable. So you are going to take at least that initiative during this week time. We're not going to let this person take you for granted. I really see you walking away from something or someone during this week time. And you know that you are worthy of more than what you are getting right now. You know that, you know, the happiness that you seek is going to happen. So you're not going to be like, you know, sticking around the wrong situation, wrong person, feeling that probably it is going to give you the happiness and you have to do or be a certain way to get that person love you. No, you are going to take stand for yourself this time around. 
you're not gonna let them hurt you you're not gonna let them take advantage of your kindness and love so you are pulling away you are surrendering your case to the God that you believe in. You are going to let God decide what you are worthy of, what you are, you know, deserving of. And you're going to allow God to bring you what you deserve. For some of you, I really feel like, you know, you are going to open yourself up to the possibility of having somebody new coming in your life as well. For others of you, you are going to open up to having either somebody new or somebody from the past that you are probably leaving if and only if they are ready to give you what you deserve so you are going to start taking care of yourself you're going to choose yourself over all and everyone right now until and unless you find the one who could love you and value you so i really see you making a major decision of your love life in this sweet time and i feel like you know this is a brilliant situation for for you to um you know initiate take initiative towards now let's see what it has to you know the for the cards has to add to the read life is wonderful and you are you know now going to dedicate yourself to your dreams um you are going to feel happy content as you choose yourself right now and i feel like you know um you are going to be reflecting upon your past decisions and actions as well during this week time but at the same time you are going to start prioritizing yourself start buying gifts for yourself you're not going to keep yourself in that situation where the other person treats you like a doormat or something you're not going to let that happen to you you are going to own your um i feel like you know to be very honest i feel like you know you overdid things in this connection with this person it's time that you're taking your power back and you are going to start loving you and yourself more than anything else and i feel like you know, that's going to get you what you want that happiness that love that you look outside of you you're going to start giving that love to yourself right now um i feel like you know there is a great success coming up for you in other areas of your life as well as you choose yourself to uh, you know, it's just more like you're owning yourself now. You're kind of like, you know, owning your power. You're taking your power back in your hands. You're going to take care of yourself a lot during this week time. I feel like you know, it's the way to go about uh, your life now. You are going to be attracting for those of you who are looking for a job or you are skipping a job or leaving a job or, you know, um, putting yourself out of a toxic uh, career uh, field. I feel like you know you're gonna pull yourself out of that and you will be given a better opportunity coming your way as well so i really see success coming for you um as you choose to you know um empower yourself with with the with the with the sense of um it's more like you you know what you're worthy of i feel like you know you were just being in a situation because you were good you were kind you were generous now it's time that you take your power back and you don't have to give things yourself your emotions to the wrong people um i feel like and there are you know wonderful times coming up for you and i feel like you know you will be having a lot of opportunities where you are going to be offered with um you know love abundance job work there's a lot that heaven is bestowing upon you right now so i feel like you know this is going to be the perfect time for you to set some new goals for yourself set some new desires and dreams for yourself to achieve to live in the future and i feel like you know as you have that understanding that you are worthy of more than anything else um that you can you know even think of you are going to set your um your your you know your expectations high and when you set your expectations high you know that you're worthy of that and that's when you are going to start attracting success in all areas of your life um let's see what else is coming in for you for this uh week time let's see what else the divine really want you to understand and take action towards <clears throat> I feel like you know for those of you who are willing to have a new relationship i really see a good news coming in here because i really see somebody new might come into your life who's going to be emotional somebody who's emotionally available somebody who's like um compassionate somebody you know it doesn't have to be a specific someone in your love life it can be a person walking into your life who is going to bring happiness commitment uh, love care back into your life if that's what your soul is craving for i really see that there is going to be a new opportunity coming up for you and this be time where you could start a new chapter in your love life with a new person so open up yourself to that as well as you choose to let go of the boss and whatever that was not working well for you so that's pretty much it coming up for you for this big time if it was of help do like share, and subscribe till i do the next read for you guys take care bye